Hey everyone, welcome back to another Dr. Twisted's Toy Time. This time I have the pleasure of showing you these Space Creature XLs. I got these off of uh, Last Resort Toys for their Black Friday sale. I want to get the whole series of these. I know I have one I did a video of way back when I first got it. But these were like basically half off from what I got that one for. So I was able to pick up two of my favorites. The uh, Tree Trunk Monster and the Horned Cyclops. I picked the Glow in the Dark version for this because I kind of think he looks like Swamp. Like a swamp creature, but like toxic. So that was the meaning of getting that color. And then I got this one in like the orangish because he looks like a like a Sasquatch type deal. But I'm I want to get different colors for each of them. I'll probably only get one of each, and uh, I wanted to pick different colors for every single one of them. But I was super happy to get these on sale and uh, get a couple more for my collection and they're based off the old um, like diner diner however you pronounced it monster erasers from way back in the day but they made these at like eight inches i believe so i'm really excited when i get my workshop done i want to display the big ones with my original small ones so let me uh i'll show you the artwork it just says space creatures xl and then it has the name this one like i said is the tree trunk monster on the bottom and then on the back it has this awesome art collect them all can't wait till they do the bat that was my absolute fave I know they have like the the Metaluna monster one made and this is the one I have already this little guy up here with the wings I got him in green but they haven't made them all yet but I can't wait to get them all so now I got one two and three and next, I'll probably get the Metaluna Mutant. And I think that I think they got another one, but I can't remember which one. I'll have to look, but I'm not sure. These things are awesome. Let me. I popped the staples already, so it wouldn't be such a, a burden getting them out. But let's get a closer look at the Tree Trunk Monster. There's no articulation in these. These things are pretty much just like a vinyl Sofubi looking deal. Get some close up details of them. I'm thinking about doing an ink wash so you can see all the details, but I don't know since he's like glow in the dark and I just, I love glow in the dark stuff. I'll probably make a shelf for all my glow in the dark stuff and just have my black light set up. To where it just makes them all pop. Look at that butt. <laughs> a very, very awesome piece that I love. If you don't know me by now, I love like swamp creatures. You know, two of my favorite comic characters are Swamp Thing and the Man Thing. And then there's like, I'm going to have like a shelf set up with. Like Moss Man and the Groot and all my forest dwellers. But that is the uh, tree trunk monster. Very cool. Let me uh, pop open. The cards are the same, except for, like I said, the bottom. This one says Horn Cyclops. But the back art is the same and everything get him out this one's an amazing figure they're both amazing and I'm so stoked to have to get these this one's just beautiful 
love Cyclops, like Sasquatch creatures. I just love all like the cryptozoology type creatures, monsters, and I do love my monsters. But the detail in these is awesome. And the butts. Very, very awesome sculpting. And he did it true to the original erasers. They didn't just do like a 3D print. He has videos of himself like sculpting these and measuring and comparing with the small ones. So everything is like perfect the way it was. Very, very cool. So stoked to have these stand them up next to each other next to my swamp scene here there you go these things are so amazing there you go my friends if you would like to check these out Go to lastresorttoys.com, all one word, as you know, in the web address. Last Resort Toys. They have all kinds of cool vinyl. I think he made like a like some of the trash bag bunch as big vinyl figures as well. Which I've been wanting to get some of them too, but these have a very special place in my heart from childhood so I have to get these first as money allows but yeah I couldn't pass up the Black Friday deals on these but there you go my friends stay tuned for my next video which will be my monthly toy haul not including you know these I already did the, the Power Rangers Snizzard and the G.I. Joe Funko Lunchbox and now these, which should be included in that, but, you know, some things I just got excited and had to do videos for, but I'll show the rest soon, probably in the next couple days. But until then, my friends, stay tuned. Peace.